everybody, Hot Rod here coming at you uh, from the Great White North, the Honky Tonk Manor. And uh, this is winter 2014. That'd be the cross between 13 and 14. It's been uh, the best winter I've seen since 1978, no doubt. At least if you're a snow lover like I am. And uh, I just wanted to document this because I'm not sure when I'll see a winter like this around this area again. This is somewhat like what you'd see up in Grayling, Michigan, let alone uh, around here. But uh, got Kimmy on the camera there. And uh, I just want to get some representation of the size of these snow piles. Uh, this is just from this driveway area. If you want to pan around Kimmy and get the driveway. And uh, this We've got an abundance of snow here. There's a series of five piles that uh, I had to deposit all of the driveway snow and a little bit of the snow in the yard. And the reason I dug up the yard, I didn't dig the yard, I've just removed the snow. But the reason I did that is to kind of create a snow break uh, to keep it from blowing into the driveway. But as you can see, this pile here is uh, probably 10, 11 foot tall. Uh, it extends back probably, it's probably about uh, 15, 15 to 18 feet at the base. So it's a, it's a real good size pile. And uh, Let's go out here to the end of the driveway. This pile at the end of the driveway is just the driveway snow uh, from here. And, uh, I've pushed this pile up here just to kind of create a, a windbreak because this is the west side. And of course, all of our all of our major wind is generally coming out of the west. We've had a couple of uh, uh, northerly winds coming straight up out of the south, and those are unusual, but it happens every now and then. I imagine this pile here is probably seven and a half feet tall, maybe, and it's a good. Uh, I ain't going in there because it's still it's probably about 10 foot uh, deep going back. Be careful. <laughs> of course, I got these little piles over here. There's a couple of things I wanted to know <clears throat> because, like I say, I don't, I don't know that uh, we'll have a drill like this for a long time. is probably about uh, I'm guessing anywhere from 26 to 28 inches total snowfall and it all started on uh, the first week of December we got about 8 inches that unfortunately melted before Christmas but uh, it's been piling on for a long time Look right over here, here's our picnic table. That's the depth of the snow there. It's gotta be, you know, like I say, uh, just just under just under three foot, between two and three feet. This is uh this is not our parking lot. This is this is the yard. And I just kinda we had a, a bunch of wind whipping around the barn from the west and it was bringing a a drift all the way through and going right across the parking lot area. So I pushed this up and that kind of contained a little bit of that. Pretty decent sized pile of snow. And then starting from here, that is just this area, which uh, we get uh, a hell of a lot of snow that drifts and blows around this side of the barn. So this pile is a good six and a half, seven feet tall, and it's uh, it's about ten feet at the base. 
over in here, all the snow in through here is right out there. We're looking into the garden area where those weeds are sticking up. That snow is no less than, than 36 inches deep. On the back side of the uh, propane tank there, that 1,000 gallon propane tank, uh, it's coming up about, uh, about 30 inches. So uh, it's been an incredible winter. I love this. I love this winter. I mean, a lot of folks don't like snow, but I'm I'm a winter sports type of guy. I'm a, it's ironically the the winter that I don't have a snowmobile, <laughs> and uh, we're going to remedy that this summer probably. But uh, yeah, I just wanted to get this and document it because I don't know when I'll ever see snow this deep around here again. So. Hot Rod from Honky Tonk Manor. Take care of y'all and uh, see ya.